sorry to come late because I got stuck with the minister's house. Uh, basically, I'm here to convert the education system of or transform the education system of India and starting with Kashmir into a connected learning community. Now, <coughs> connected learning community is the latest concept in education, which is a 2020 vision of UNESCO. Now, this in the previous years. There was a philosophical system. It gave rise to a four walls of the classroom that started by Aristotle, the Western education system, where people used to be put into age groups and start teaching them. Now, the new system is the ability-based system. I was just with the minister today, and he was so impressive and said a lot of things about what our vision of the world is, and it confirmed with what we are doing. Now, the Kashmir schools, I met them in Bangalore, about a year back and they had so much of enthusiasm to convert themselves into the new basic system. So in this system what happens is we are going away from the three walls of the class, or the four walls of the class arithmetic to five C's. That is creativity, critical thinking, integration and computational thinking. Now if you know all the students, suppose you give them any device, they will be able to handle it because they are very good in computational thinking. Unfortunately, what happens is, our elders have a problem with the, with the new, uh, new computer, computers and the devices and things like that. So, what we are trying to do in Kashmir is, start by training the teachers first, and then go to the homes and give a software which is worth about say 25,000 rupees to each child, and see that they start learning from there on. Now, as you know that Kashmir has a problem of closure of schools and we know there's a problem in Kashmir. So, a connected learning community will help us reduce that problem. That is, we can have the teachers online and anytime there is no, uh, there, there is no classes in the classroom, it could be done online. But you would ask me, supposing there's the internet connectivity also is not there, then how do we manage this? See, we are talking about the EduNet. Uh, EduNet is basically a private network only for educational institutions and the students and the government together.